a Tuesday night. Tonight, the second of four to begin the week between the San Francisco Giants and the San Diego Padres. Ladies and gentlemen, yo, it's San Diego on the show, and it's coming Padre. up next. Batting Gerald four. Hayden as he'll the dig into baseman. the left-handed batter's Gerald. box. I'm so impressed Hayden. with him and his ability to hit from both sides of the dish. I mean, we've all seen guys that do it, but really, they usually struggle from one side of the plate or the other. One, Not him, right. though. He's a true switch hitter who has a lot of success from either side of the box. Guys, you take a look at the Giants as they begin play here tonight. They're coming off another victory last time out, and now they're winners of eight of their last nine ball games. Hey, they come into game two of this series riding high. A huge one-run hey, victory on, yesterday. Up. Able to do the little things to put them over the top. I got a ball Hopefully that leads to some momentum in game two. What I love right there is just the freedom in that hack. He ain't trying to do anything but hit the baseball as far as he can. Now, and that one misses badly. It's ball two. Stay hot, baby. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. Booyah! So a two-run homer down the line in left. The ninth of the ninth in his amazing career. As the Padres have taken a two-to-nothing lead. And we'll see what he can do here after going Zero. deep his first time up. He Easy. turned around that fastball and drove it out of the park in his previous at bat. So there's got to be a good chance they mix it up right here on him and try and go off speed. And this will be fouled away. Bases are empty, one man out. Hey, one right here. Come on now. Oh, right back to him on the mound. And he'll just flip this on to first for the second out of the inning. Now to bat, Gerald Payton number bounced 15. out last time up. Yeah, Gerald. I understand that, Matty, but this hey guy's there. got burner wheels down the first baseline. I don't think he even concerns himself with that. He has to put it on the ground. That's part of what makes him successful. Find your pitch right here. Find it. Hey, you're doing good. No one's better up there. Let's go. As a look, now the pitch. Back up the middle. And it's through into center field. Base hit. And the run is in to score from second. It's a four to three game. And now time is called here as their pitching coach is going to pay a quick visit to the mound to discuss how they want to attack things here. So next to hit is Robert Hassel grounded out Robert in his last at bat. Robert. Looking to keep this Hassel. a one run game, the pitch. Smoke the other way, high and deep to left. A ball that's carrying. And he makes a nice catch on the track as that ends the inning. Friars forced to settle for just the one. We're through five here at the ballpark. Padres lead it four to three. Toribio. So far, two for three in this one. Here comes the one two. Goes the other way as this is lined to left. And he will make the play out there, and there are two away now. Boy, talk about hitting into some rough luck. That was an absolute bullet to the outfield that gets caught, and he would have represented the tying run. 
Bottom of inning number eight set to go. go. And standing in is the veteran third, the third baseman, baseman, Gerald Hayden. Gerald Hayden. Now the first pitch. Wind up and the 0 1. Into center field, line drive base hit. The throw into second, and he's safe. safe. When you're leading by one run, you want to do everything you can to add to the lead and give your bullpen a little breathing room. It makes a big difference, so double here goes a long way towards making that a real possibility. Nobody out. And in the next is Robert Hassel. Robert Hassel. Line but speared on a hop. And they will not get him at first as he's able to leg out the throw. And this will score the run from second to make this a 5-3 game now. Dan, that's a huge insurance run right there. Has to feel good as a hitter right there to not only get a ribby knock, but to give your team a little bit of breathing. It, it does, and it makes your pitcher go out there with a little bit more free and easy frame of mind instead of going in a one-run. Well, that's not exactly how you play. 